Morning vlog. It is January 11th, 2023. And I'm gonna start this little vloggy vlog. I think it's gonna be like two days in my life because I've got some two kind of like exciting days at work that I would love to take you guys along for. 8 a.m. and I'm getting ready to go to the gym. Today, St. John's is playing in the first ever collegiate women's basketball game at UBS Arena, which is the home of the New York Islanders. Um, so that's really exciting. The game is at 8 p.m. and I'm producing the entire show. So I wrote the script, um, all the lighting cues, all the sound cues, um, and I'll be kind of calling that from the uh, scores table. Tomorrow, me and the other social media director, as well as our mascot, we are going to the Empire State Building and doing a collab with them. So that's gonna be really exciting. I I'm just, I'm excited for the next two days. Like I said, I'm starting with the gym this morning. I don't know actually if I said that, but um, during Vlogmas, I started going to the gym again um, at Lifetime Fitness. And um, I think I started Peloton after that, but I've been just using the Peloton app, doing runs, doing boot camps. So I'm gonna do a 30 minute Broadway walk on peloton and then i'm at the gym i'll go in the steam room there read my book because that's my favorite thing to do in the morning just for 10 minutes and then take a shower and then get ready for the day Ooh, okay that was such a good workout um, again, like it was just a 30 minute Peloton walk, um, but I really enjoyed it. And then I went in the steam room afterwards and I read, um, I don't know what it's called, but it's the sequel to They Both Die at the End by Adam Silvera. And I loved that book. So now I'm reading the sequel, or I guess it's technically a prequel, but it doesn't focus on the same character. So it doesn't matter. Then I took a shower and now I have my hair up in this like scrunchie from Kitsch. Um, it's supposed to be like a towel drying scrunchie. I don't know if like actually does anything but my hair was wet so i put it in it and now i'm gonna go get a diet coke go home do my makeup do my hair get dressed and that's my plan all right diet coke secured i'm gonna start getting ready momentarily but first i gotta go on my computer and i have to submit payroll for st john's because the grind never stops i do like our payroll for all of our game day staff and things like that so just have to get that submitted to our office so everyone gets money <laughs> uh, okay it's 10 32 i gotta leave my house by 11 30 so we're gonna speed makeup and stuff right now make a pair all of that it's gonna get done it's gonna be fine realistically i could do everything at ubs but mm, let's just try to get it all done now okay i can't believe this is happening this whole um little suit is from bishop and young Bla uh turtleneck um is from amazon and booties are chinese laundry um i can't believe this is actually happening um i feel like this has been in the works for so long so many people have worked so hard to make this happen and i'm so excited to go ah! all right we just had to get gas and then i went to the bagel store and i picked up a bagel to eat right now and then i also grabbed just like a bag of snacks that they had just to bring with me for you know me my friends my staff um just so because it's gonna be a long day oh i'm getting so excited guys oh this is so cute guys i'm so excited like Okay, I did a tour of like the artist lounge last year, so I'll just do a tour again because no one's in here, so like I can do that. Here is an overview. There's a table. I assume like they'd have food over there for the artist if there was an artist here, and then this couch and stuff. They like redecorated all of this. It didn't look like this last year when I was here. And then this way, there's a bathroom right here. And then that's another artist lounge that we're using as our media workspace for tonight. Um, these are the snacks I brought, by the way. And then there's this like kids room, but again, they redid it since last year. It's way nicer than it was last year. It's like all full out. 
looks like this. And then there's like toys in these, I remember. You know, children's toys. I think coloring books are in one of them. Yeah, coloring. More coloring. Candyland. Maybe I can get a game going on later. And then this way, this is like a mother parenting, like nursing suite, which is nice. They really thought everything through here. Um, I think they did a fantastic job. I mean, it's beautiful outside. I'll show you guys the hallway too. It's beautiful. Like, it's beautiful. All right, I'm in the elevator now. I'm going up to P, which is press level, but it's also where media, catwalk, and um, the control room is. So I'm going up to the control room to talk to lighting to set up all the lighting cues for the floor. It's like press level for hockey, so. So, just talk to you, lighting, director, everything like that. Everything's running super smoothly from my end. Um, we're gonna like test everything at 6.05 after we do our national anthem sound check. So, everything's like coming along, which is like not the place I thought we would be in. Um, also, this is the Islanders locker room. Um, apparently no one's allowed in there, but um, that's where the bodies are buried. <laughs> I did. I told Brendan he had to say hi to the vlog, and he said, oh gosh. So here he is saying hi to the vlog. <laughs> the bathroom has a dry bar blow dryer. So Maddie's gonna give herself a little blowout. I have a hairbrush. Do you want it? <laughs> constantly on the move going back up to uh, press level right now to grab headsets um, then we're doing sound check testing ah! <laughs> it's, we're so close I'm honestly so excited oh. guys I'm so excited their headsets actually work unlike the ones we have at home so like I'm I'm thriving I posted an Instagram story of Maddie with the dry bar hair dryer and dry bar liked my mention of them. <laughs> Game's over. We unfortunately did not win, but production slayed. So I'm happy. The next day. Don't mind me, just um, finding the streets in New York City. Thank mm -hmm. you.